For more thoughts, let's go back to Barclays. Ian Eagle and Sarah Kustak. Bob, another win for the Brooklyn Nets. This one got dicey down the stretch. Knicks show a lot of heart, and it's a pretty clear indication how improved this Knicks squad is under Tom Thibodeau. From the Nets' point of view, James Harden, another triple-double. That's 10 now. <laughs> Kyrie Irving, big scoring numbers once again. Uh, this was another grinded-out type of effort, very similar to that Detroit game. This thing was still up in the air late. Yeah, I mean, down till the final possessions. And I think the Nets have continued to talk about how they've learned about each other, their team, yeah. and collectively winning in different ways. And once again, to your point, this is similar to what was said after the Detroit game about a grinded-out win. And it's not quite the same, given the way that the game started and how offensively efficient this Nets team was. Uh, but the Knicks' defense is what it is, and yeah. they have found this success for a reason on what they can do on that end. And they certainly up the intensity level, the type of pressure, the type of looks that the Nets were able to get. But overall, the uh, Brooklyn Nets have found a way to close out games when it matters and we saw those same type of activities here tonight and at the end of the day what matters to them is walking away with another win yeah it looked like the nets were going to score 125 130 points knicks clamped them down in that fourth quarter and new york actually had opportunities down the stretch yeah. missed a bunch of shots but because of that suffocating defense it lengthened the game for new york and they stayed in it uh, i think the nets are going to take away from this very similar to what you were just saying sarah the ability to find ways to win sometimes not the prettiest but certain pockets of this game was just simply beautiful offense from brooklyn and i think that's a special part we begin to see when it's james harden and we know he didn't have a great shooting night no. but how he was able to facilitate for his teammates it's something that has become typical of what we anticipate out of him, but the continued decision-making and what type of ways that allows the confidence of some of these yep. other players to flourish. And still, Nicholas Claxton looked really good. The the shots and, and the great shooting streak of Landry Shamit as he continues um, to find his rhythm. You can go down the list of some of these different players. Jeff Green, of course, the big game um, that he had, particularly what he did in that first half. But I think, again, the collective nature of this team and how the stars are stars, Kyrie Irving, putting on a show, James Harden with some big numbers, but everyone playing their part, playing a role, and I think in the big picture for this team, that's what matters most. And the Nets will have Indiana coming up. Emotional game for not just the Nets players, but Nets fans who have watched Karis LeVert develop into the player and person that he is today. Nets continue to put pressure on the Philadelphia 76ers who still hold on to the number one spot in the Eastern Conference. Back to you. Bob and Frank.